Good morning, Your Majesty. Good morning. How are you? What's your name? Brandon Eugene Acuff. I'm sorry to be here, but every time I always step outside, I get in trouble. I can't go anywhere. I'm the one that called 911, and I'm the one that ended up in jail. A man pulled a firearm on me and cocked it. Let me let me read. Let me get through this. So you've been charged with disorderly conduct. That would be a Class C misdemeanor. If convicted and resisting a stop, arrest, or search, that'd be a but Class B misdemeanor. If convicted. You understand what you're charged with? I do, but I didn't commit the crimes. I understand. Would you like me to read the allegations? What they're claiming you did? Yes, please. It says, this incident occurred on or about Wednesday, November 30th, 2022 at 3615 Sutherland Avenue. On that date, time, and location, Officer Townsend responded to a disorderly conduct or fighting at the good stop. Officers received a call of the defendant, Brandon Acuff, attempting to fight customers in the parking lot. Place. One second. Upon arrival, officers observed Acuff screaming at the public. Acuff then observed officers and stated, don't come near me, and if you put your hands on me, I'm going to throw hands. Officers then gave Acuff verbal commands to turn around and place his hands behind his back. A Acuff I'll stop you for a second. No. Because I, I was sitting on the ground no, when they pulled up. Me. Don't stop me. Officer, I'm just reading what they're saying you did. Officers attempted to use directional controls to maneuver Acuff's hands behind his back. Acuff pulled away from officers, attempting to stand up. Officers were able to place Acuff into custody after a brief struggle. Acuff was then taken into custody without incident. This occurred in North Nose County, Tennessee. Alrighty, so you will have an opportunity to be heard on this. You'll get a chance to go to court and argue the case. But right now, we're just... This is this is more of doing the arrangements, setting you up for court, get you an attorney. So, would you like me to appoint an attorney if you cannot afford one? I can appoint one. I'm already with David Skidmore. If you'd like to go ahead and do David Skidmore again, if you want me to appoint an attorney, I'll appoint an attorney. If it's if you've already got one, it's usually the same one. Okay. I need to ask you some questions on oath, make sure you qualify, and set your bonds. So you raise your right hand and be sworn in. This is the uniform affidavit of indigency that you filled out of the jail. You swear or affirm that everything you filled out on this form, any testimony you give is true and accurate? Except for the uh, month, I put 11 instead of 12. I put 11 instead you of 12. Next that. I can change that. That part, you're not swearing to the date anyway. Uh, you said everything on this form, okay. sir. Okay. All righty. You can put your hand down. I really hate to be here. I don't like it. I, I'm sorry I had to come, but I won't call on the morning anymore. You I'll never call 911 again. You have a job? I was looking for a job because I just got out of jail. Working for what? Look, I was looking for employment because I just bonded out of jail. I had to pay $800 to get out of jail. I had to sell my vehicle. Then I got kicked off the bus, and my cousin kicked me out, and my mom was going to kick me out, so I called the cops on her the same night. I called the cops on Jeff the same night. It turns out he had warrants on him, so he got arrested. Then I had to go down, and I was rolling cigarettes and giving people presents like Santa. And um, a man pulled a firearm on me, so I called the police like I was supposed to do because I got arrested for showing a man a pencil one time and got aggravated assault. So if a man shows a firearm that's fully loaded and cocked it, he should be charged the same as me. And I gave them the tag numbers. And then the man that owned the store, or at least running and being manager, said that I needed to leave. And I didn't feel safe for my life, so I called the police. So I will never do that again. I will never call the police again. I will never, ever do that again. Okay. Any property, house, or car that you own? I don't own anything because I'm homeless. Any other forms of income or of assets? No, sir. I'm unemployed. I'm looking for employment. Okay. Do you live in Could you please let me just get ROR? I have no money. I would have to beg and plead for anything I have. I and I don't like to beg or plead. Not with a, a November arrest and these being the charges that they are. Uh, we're supposed to set a bond and then set you a bond hearing for it to be heard. And then the judge can release you. And so... So I have to stay. We'll get there. You have family here? No, do you live here? Yeah. How long you lived here? My whole life. Do you have family here? Yes. Who's that? 
My sister, my mother, my father, everyone. Is there anybody that would vouch for your liability to show up in court? What does that mean? Anybody that would say that you're responsible and that you're going to come to court? Yeah, me. I'm always responsible. I always come to court. But yeah, they would show up too. Okay, I'm going to set the bond on the disorderly at 250 and on the resisting at 500. So it's 750 total. God damn, man. You're a fucking asshole. Thank you, bitch. Have a good fucking morning. Take that back. I'm actually not going to set his bond. I'm just going to set him for court on Monday for them to arraign him. Are you there, officer? Hello. Is the officer there? Yeah, he's right there. Yes, I am, sir. Yeah, he's right here. I'm actually going to undo setting his bond. I think it's better that it be taken up in court with a judge at this point. For his arraignment. I'm going to set him next day arraignment on Monday. Does that mean? Is that better or worse? They're going to give you a arraignment. Is that better or worse? I'm going to go to court on Monday. I'm going to It's today, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday. Day Monday, Friday. Yeah, so I don't have no better because I, get, I get released, right? So I don't have to pay any more fucking money to the people like this. Come on, God damn. Come on now, bitch. Come on, man. Hello. Oh, You see how the white respect I personally it's the number of you see how the respect you can spit on my fucking face. Oh yeah, I'm 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 just gonna I'm just gonna